Corporal Steve Hansen says he has seen a lot during his eight years with the Sawatch Sheriff's Department. Oh yeah, most definitely. But nothing like what he saw inside this house in Crestone last week, a partially decomposed woman's body. And that was just the beginning. Definitely strange and out of the ordinary. Corporal Hansen said the body was found in the back room of the house, set up on what appeared to be some type of a shrine in a sleeping bag on a bed. He also said the body was fully clothed, decorated with Christmas lights, and with glitter makeup around its eyes. I'm really not sure what to think about this whole thing. The body has not yet been positively identified, but a witness named in the arrest warrant said it belonged to Leah Carlson, the leader of the cult Love Has Won, who also goes by the name Mother God. The Sawatch Sheriff's Department says the cause of death has not yet been determined, but it does not appear that foul play was involved. Seven people have, however, been arrested and charged with abuse of a corpse, essentially not taking proper care of a dead body. They were all in the house when the body was found. According to the arrest warrant, five of the people who were arrested drove Carlson's body from California to Colorado recently. I've never seen a group of people be so nonchalant about a dead person in their back room. Does it concern you that you live so close to them? Yeah, it does. Mark Adams says he has lived near the Love Has One house for the past three years. He says he's never had any problems with the people who live there. They usually keep to themselves. But is now deeply concerned after hearing the news. Having an occult live this close to me, it's really, it's really kind of crazy. Keeping the dead in, in, inside the house. Why would you want to do that? In Crestone, Matt Javlo, 9 News. Yeah, that's a good question. A 13-year-old girl and a 2-year-old boy were asleep in the home when sheriff's deputies found the body. They were said to be in good condition. The seven people arrested were also charged with child abuse for having the children in the house with a dead body.